you know, you talk about white tradition, I want to say that it is true. It is a white tradition where they come here and they say yeah, and they capitalize on people's art. Can, can I introduce Kimberly Rib Rivers yeah, Roberts? Kimberly Rivers Roberts. Yeah. I am the maker of Trouble the Water. My film was Oscar nominated and we won Sundance Best Documentary Prize. These are the images right here from my community in Katrina, 2005. My family, my husband, and hundreds of other people survived this catastrophe. And here you have people that are coming in and swooping in like vultures and taking advantage of people's survival story for their own self because they don't have art. They don't have their own stories. They don't have their own pictures, their own life experience that they can share with the world. So a, a lot in Africa training, they've been coming into these communities, predominantly poor communities, and taking their art and doing what the hell they want to do with it. And the classic case is this. This is my home. This is my survival. That's my water. That's my shot. And this man right here just takes my shit and sell his books with it. We would like to use your shit. Instead, he go look for a law and say, oh, I'm gonna protect myself with this law right here. And so, use your shit and don't give you nothing. So, so yeah, don't, don't take that away from the story. That's my house. That's my, that's my friend street. That's my husband shot. and I, we, I shot that from my attic. So go ahead and respond, man. So oh, yeah. you, you have no respect. You don't have no respect for people art. You don't have no respect for black art. You don't have you one of them white men that come from the north that steal black people shit and so, use it for your own personal gain. And we sick of people like you. I'm not. You go your ass back up north where you belong. Don't come down I'm here making our shit. Experiencing well, a lot why of respect. Well, why my bitches on your shit and you ain't contact me? In this me? setting, I'm not experiencing a lot of respect for you. Would you mind? Are you out of hey, You ain't you respect me. Let me respond. You know why should we let you? You ain't let me. So, um, Miss Roberts contacted me on Thursday night. Mm -hmm. She and I spoke on Friday morning. Uh -huh. um, and she expressed her concerns uh -huh. to me. So, may I please un uninterrupted? No, fuck no, 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 no. You ain't gonna tell so, me. That. You're talking about respect. You're gonna tell you. I'm not, I don't respect. have no respect for you, man. Look at my shit. I'm glad your kids are around you. Hey, I hope she do see it, and I'm exactly. filming so I can show her your response. Absolutely not. You don't live my life. You ain't got no, no problems with nobody stealing shit from you. You white and you a male. You ain't got no problem with nobody stealing your shit. They respect you, huh? But I gotta take my respect. Cause people like you and him don't have no fucking respect. Y'all just take white privilege too fucking far and take and take what the fuck you want from people and use it and say, oh, it's mine now. That's what the hell happened. Hey, it's proof. May I please Check the book. return and my the man. It's on the front of that book. My shot from Katrina. My survival. This man is using for his own personal gain. You a thief. You low down, and the devil is in your fucking ass. You heard me? Good job, Queen. Let's go. You a thief, and you low down. And this ain't the fucking end, bitch, because I'm a fighter. And I'm a fight to the end, because you ain't going to get away with this shit. Tired of y'all coming, stealing our shit down here in New Orleans. So all y'all do, come down here and steal our shit, and then leave, and leave us poor. Where were your pictures at that he took them? In Katrina. Were they posted online? How did he get them? No, he took them from the damn documentary. The documentary we made, Trouble the Water. He didn't even give me the fucking the right. He didn't just took all my rights away from me to take my shit and make it his. Fuck my children. Fuck my daughter. Like she ain't pulled the hair or nothing. Thirty-five dollars a pop. That's all my pictures on there, Maggie. Oh, that's my shit. That's my fucking blood on this shit. If I don't stand up for my shit, then I ain't got shit. You gotta stand up for yourself. And you, you don't even have a fucking clue what it is to be stole from, cause you fucking white. Yeah, no you fucking white privilege. Yeah. You ain't got a clue. Let me tell you something. What? Help rude people that are not rude. Yeah. If I don't be rude and fucking stand up for myself, then people like you just continue to kick me up the fucking ass. Right. You I side with like your white brother now. just now. He is now. Come on well, now. You, well, you ain't got to. Rules. He the same color this as you and he's a fucking new generation. Male. People are tired. I'm wrong. Well, why the fuck do you say? Why you have no sympathy or empathy for my shit? Because you don't give a fuck. It's culture. It's culture. It's people's ways of life being so like. I don't want no empathy. I want the right to my shit. I want people not to steal from me. You ain't never been stole from. Andrew, this is not how to act. I act. That's all the fuck you concerned about is an act. You ain't gonna tell me what to do. You're not gonna tell me how to feel. You used to controlling people. You ain't gonna control me, motherfucker. You tripping. You better get the fuck with that dumb ass shit. Stealing my shit. And then you gonna side with the motherfucker that stole my shit. Your white brother. Fuck all y'all white thieves. 
Y'all can kiss my ass. I'm a fighter. Shame I'm a die you. fighting. You ain't stealing from me. You best believe shame that shit. No shame on your fucking nature, on your DNA.